What is up everybody? Today is the day we're gonna be starting the YouTube channel for the supercar from scratch build. This is the Spectra S and I started an Instagram page just to show off what was going on and see what people thought about it. You guys have been super awesome. I've had a ton of support and love. It has been super motivating to keep up the progress and keep it going faster because I wanna keep posting more content for you guys. Um, and so this is gonna be the first video of the series. Uh, Basically, just to answer some questions that you guys have been having. What underneath is not the frame? This is just temporary to get the uh, form built up. From this, we put rebar around in the rough shape that we needed, and then foam, expanding foam on top of that. From there, the expanding foam gets covered with a drywall mud. You can see some of the foam through the mud in spots that have been sanded back. And then on top of that, just because the drywall mud wants to crack, you can see it's everywhere with the cracks so a few layers of drywall mud and then some body filler with fiberglass mixed in just to hold it all together once that's all done and i get one side perfect the way i like i can transfer that to the other side um, the process of measuring it all that's gonna come later and when i do that you guys will see the process so it's easier to show it than explain it um, basically what's covered right now is the shape that i need it and want it to be i'm happy with that and then what's not in green and not in body filler. I'm still kind of working that out and getting it to look the way that I want it to be. So once we have uh, this side done, I'm waiting on the windshield right now to come in. It's a Lotus Elise windshield that I ordered. Shout out to Car Building Cowboy for letting me know about that one. Um, it's got a nice curve to it. So once I get that in, I can cut out whatever I need and then kind of reshape the roof a little bit. So from there, um, really it's just a matter of fiberglassing the body, throwing all this away in the end, and then building a frame. Um, I'm thinking tubular steel frame as of now, just because a whole carbon fiber tub would be way too expensive to engineer and build myself in my garage with the mess, as you can see. But steel frame, mount the panels, drop an engine in it, not 100% decided yet what kind of engine I want. I just know that I want to make it somewhere around 800 to 1,000 horsepower. Um, in my mind, I'm thinking maybe some something LS twin turbo. You know that'll go pretty crazy on its own. And then interior, of course, full custom. So stay tuned. I'm probably gonna just shoot a couple clips of me working on the car, and that'll be it for this first video. It's kind of the introduction to the build. Thank you guys all for watching uh, and. Uh, Please like, comment, and subscribe.